What's up, people? I'm back, man. I'm currently on the way to go speak to these little kids on juvenile probation. They headed down the wrong path, so I'm trying to sprinkle a little game on them, man, and get them on the right track, get them on the right path, let them know it's a better way than just going in and out of jail. And ain't no good outcome of being in the streets, man. I'll let y'all know how I go when I get out. What's up, man? I just got up out of there. Shout out to all the kids in there. I hope they took some of that game that I tried to sprinkle them with, ran with it, and I hope they don't, you know what I'm saying, continue to go down that path they're going down, man. And, you know, I really felt felt bad, you know what I'm saying, for a lot of them, because a lot of these kids, they, you know, they don't come from no good home, and they just in a fucked up situation, man. Just praying for them. Hope, you know, hope they just do the right thing. It's not easy, man. But like I said, there's America, man. There's America. Anybody, that's the richest country in the world. You know what I'm saying? Anybody could make it. You ever notice why, how them corner stores and a lot of stores are owned by Koreans or Chinese people or Arabians? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Middle Eastern people. You know why? Because the country they come from is so poor and in so much poverty that they say, I'm going to go to America and I'm going to make something of my life. I'm going to go to America and I'm going to start me a business because that's the land of the free. Anybody can make a business. But we born here, we're here in America, and we don't realize how blessed we are. So we're lazy. I'm guilty of it too. I'm not, I'm not saying everybody else. Me too, everybody. We don't realize how blessed we are because we've just been here all our lives and we didn't grow up in these other countries. We need to start taking advantage of this democracy that we live in. You gotta believe in yourself too, man. The mind is a powerful weapon, man. You gotta believe in yourself. Wake up in the morning and tell yourself you a millionaire. Even if you're not, even if you got two cents in your pocket, wake up and say, I'm a millionaire. I'm gonna get it today. That's what I do. I just got home. What you Daddy. doing, Gigi? Hi, Dad. Hi. <laughs> Leah, Leah, have y'all brushed y'all teeth? I did. Houston. Hi, babe. Hi, Kelly Jean. Houston, look, it's Dada. Dada. Mm -hmm. And you, what are you doing? Mrs. Luciano TV. <laughs> How'd it go? It went good. I'm so proud of you, babe. It was quicker than I thought. Tell me all about it. I never done that before, so I was just like, uh, what else do I say? <laughs> After I said what I was gonna say, uh, you can't just talk straight for like 30 minutes, you know what I'm saying? And it's different when you're having a conversation with somebody because then they talk back to you. But when you're just talking by yourself, after I talk for like five minutes straight, I'm like, okay, uh, y'all got any questions? I gave you your little note. I didn't take no notes. I should have took some notes. I told you, y'all, yeah, I like, been telling him all week that he needs to sit down and write on a notebook or on his uh, notes on his phone. Well, There's next time points, I'm gonna take some notes. Key points so whenever he gets stuck, he looks at his notes and he's like, okay, this is another key point I want to bring up. I even made him one last night and I sent it to his phone and he didn't use it. Anyway, what's for lunch? I haven't even had breakfast. I know, I'm sorry. Um, they had some tacos there. I ate a taco, but just one. It was just one taco. <laughs> Yesterday he just finished eating two tacos and then like he goes, oh, okay, I'm ready for lunch and the insurance guy goes, didn't you just eat? <laughs> I was just too, I told what I tell him, I said, man, that was it's my appetizer. appetizer. That was my appetizer, man. Shoot, it's Father's Day weekend, man. I gotta do it big. What do you want to do? Oh, Ace wanted to know we wanted to go to the lake for Father's Day. I'm down. Whatever you want to do, it's your day. <laughs> Let me just... Can we just finish um, doing this real quick and then we'll Working on a weekend, man. We working on a weekend. If you ain't got your uh, shirt already, go to LucianoTV.com and place your order today. I said LucianoTV.com and place your order today. You look cute, Gigi. Thank you. <laughs> we got fans everywhere. <laughs> we brought the girls to the taco stand. Babe, I can't take you nowhere. Uh, my bad, man. It's that truck. I can't take him nowhere. Literally, 
We were just getting out of the car. The fans pulled up. What did you get? I got fruit water. And that's water? Mm. Lemonade. Hi, bye. We got you a gordita, babe. Got me a pupusa as usual. He got three tacos, and I think I'm gonna want one of them. So we just realized we got a plan. Good thing we're next door to a tire shop. Uh, uh, <laughs> when you eat so much, you can't even breathe right. Kelly always making fun of the way I breathe, especially after I eat. Show them how you breathe. He goes, he goes like this, like y'all. Yeah. It's because I hold my breath in and then I let out all my air at the same time. Yeah. He goes, <sighs> and I'm like, damn. She looks at me and be like, can you just not breathe? No, can you breathe? Can you really like just breathe? Cause he like stops breathing for a while and that's why he like lets it out like that. Anyway, I got a flat tire, man. And I ain't got no spare. So I know y'all wondering why you don't get out and change the tire. I don't got a spare tire. So it's funny because every time we go to like to a Mexican place or something, like he gets to talking the to the The dude's people. name is Homer. So I'm like, don't that's not Homer. No, but he was like, Oh yeah, I'm here at the tire shop. Like, but he gets like an accent and he doesn't <laughs> talk like that. And so he's like, are you here? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. It's hilarious, you guys. Well, when I talk to Arabian people at the store, at the corner store, I talk with an Arabian accent. Do it. Where did I put my camel? <laughs> <laughs> that is like, that's just borderline messed up. No, much love. Much love to all races, all ethnicities, everybody, human oh, kind. Yes. Siéntate bien, niña. We're waiting on the guy to get here because the struggle is real. He had to go somewhere down the street to go get the tire that the car takes. They don't he didn't have a carry 22 inch tires, which is kind of weird to me. Well, they probably got 22 inch tires, but there's a certain type of tire it is, so they didn't have it. Yeah, and we go through this every single time oh. that we need a new tire. It's like they have to order. There he is. Don't miss that. Que paso? Que pa Homer? That's what we're driving on. Oh. We back rolling like we never missed a beat, baby. Shout out to Homer's tire shop. He fixed it so quick, so fast with Olympic speed, you did. He really drove down the street to go get this tire, too. So, I'm looking crazy, man. All right, let's go home and go to sleep. I'm ready for a siesta. <sighs> you guys, I low key miss Kingston. Um, Y'all are probably wondering where he's at. He actually went camping with his grandpa. Not camping, fishing. Oh, they went fishing. He's supposed to be coming back today, and I can't wait because I miss him. Even, even though he gets on our nerves, he's like, he brightens up our day. So, Kingston, when you see this, I love you, you little twerp. <laughs> <laughs> y'all look at me for a second, right? Type in the comments, let us know where y'all want us to go for our next meet and greet. I think it's time for another pop up shop. Let, we already went to Dallas. So type in the comments, let us know which city you want to see us in and whichever city got the most votes. No. What you mean no, Leah? You don't want to go do it again? You probably need to get tired again. Well, you can stay with your grandma. Yay! I'm going. Let us know which city you want to see us in. Type it in the comments and whichever city got the most votes, we're going to pop up. I'm going to give y'all some advice. Y'all get y'all a car, new car, don't put wheels on it. Just keep the factory wheels on it. It drives better with the factory wheels. And, Save gas. and whenever you have a flat tire, you're going to have to buy an expensive tire. Wait, what are factory wheels? The wheels that the car comes with. New record. I feel like Houston's getting more bad and bad and bad. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. <clears throat> I love you. He just keeps screaming and screaming and screaming, man. He just, he wants to get carried all the time. He's spoiled and he finally went to sleep. He's asleep right now, but he's been bad all morning. 
It is Father's Day today, so happy Father's Day to all you hardworking daddies out there. Happy Father's Day to everybody. Happy Father's Day to the single mothers that have to be the mama and the daddy. Happy Father's Day to all y'all. Only if you take care of your kids and handle your business as a dad. I like I like how I grabbed the camera and I'm the one that turned it on and I was like gonna vlog and he just came over here and just like snatched it off my hand and was like, Hi you guys. Baby, this is my show, baby. Boy, shut up. Oh, so no, man. it's Father's Day. We wanted to go to the lake today to Lake Conroe uh, with Ace and but it's about to rain, man. It just it started thundering. It was raining yesterday and I think it's gonna rain again today, so we we don't know what we're gonna So do. our plans were ruined and I keep on trying to ask Lucky what he wants to do and he's like, I don't know. I wanted to go to the lake and go fishing, but it's been a rain. And another reason why we haven't left is because Kingston's still not here, so you need to call up and uh, you know. No, up. they said they're bringing him at three. Why do you got this hot mama dress on? Like you finna go to the club or something? I got it on for you, daddy. Already. <laughs> like We're gonna have to get back with y'all. We'll be back. Hi. Houston. You just woke up? You just be crying over nothing. What is that, Gigi? It's a party secret. Too bad from Gigi. Thank you, baby girl. You're welcome. Father's Day poem. My dad is a person. Did you make this up? No. <laughs> <laughs> Read it out loud. My dad can be one of your very best Wait, friends. You Father's Day poem. A dad is a person who is loving and kind and often he knows what's on your mind. He's someone who listens, suggests, and defends. A dad can be one of your very best friends. He's proud of your triumphs, but when things go wrong, a dad can be patient and helpful and strong. And all that you do with dad's love, what they say? Plays a part. Plays a part. <laughs> There's always a place for him deep in your heart. Thank you, Dad, for listening and caring, for giving and sharing, but especially for being you. All right, Aww. Let me see your shirt. What does it say? Love my dad. So Leah just came through with her card, and look at this sticker. It got to do with the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for everything you gave us. I love you, Dad. <laughs> World's best daughter. It's all dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Did you pick this up today just because it was fun? Nah. Y'all did. Y'all so sweet. Hi, Houston. Like he likes to buy the little packs from HEB that are already like cut and ready to go. So I don't want to take all the credit. What? Stand up. Whoa. Whoa. You hitting the whoa? Thank you, my baby girl. You got me feeling like a king over here. Eating this steak just cooked just like I like it. Nice and red in the middle. Mmm. <laughs> Hold on, baby. You're spoiling me now, baby. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> now what am I going to eat? We just finished brunch and guess who came home? I don't have a shirt on, guys. Silky Slim. Silky Slim got a sunburn. Let me see your back. I can't even Boy, see got it. dark. You caught some fish? What kind of fish you caught? I caught a redfish and a speckled trout. And I caught a bunch of other fish. 
But like I don't know what they were called. And they were small. Y'all fishing on well, on a boat or what? No, we went to a. Uh, I missed him. <laughs> Are you crying? <laughs> don't ever leave me for that long. <laughs> it's uh no we went we went to we were standing on this no it was like a beach. And but the water was right here, and then there was a drop off. And that's where we were fishing. Y'all can't see it, but oh yeah, dark clouds and the wind is blowing. So that weather just got me chilling today, man. I ain't really doing nothing. Oh, we weren't gonna vlog today because I don't like putting whack vlogs up. But we didn't vlog yesterday because of that same reason, and I can't just be doing that, man. So we're gonna bless y'all with a little something, something today. Happy Father's Day. Shout out to Jose Martinez because he said he's been patiently waiting for a shout out. And shout out to Allison Roy. She was asking, what do you have to do in order to get a shout out from the channel TV? And girl, you did it. All you gotta do is comment, show us some love, make sure you're subscribed, make sure your post notifications are on, and just like this video, give us a thumbs up. Don't forgive me for my sins, cause I'm doing bad. See, I'm addicted to them diamonds and them candy slabs.